Hey guys, Lee here, Theme Park Ohana. Coming back at you again. Like I said, we're gonna get more regular videos in. I have a few hours to kill between stroller deliveries, so I'm figuring walk around pop a little bit because this is one of my favorite resorts visually. Um, and look behind me, got the Skyliner, so beautiful. And I'm just gonna, and I'll probably take you guys with me to the other resorts I have to go to today. I got like four more. So follow the adventure. could just sit here and watch the skyliner all day it is so pretty and this lake has a name so bonus points for anybody that could name the lake no cheating i will know to get there little buddy you find something to eat you don't like me oh he scratched Got I love the little details here, like there's Lady, and on the other side's Tramp. But did you know they use the pool house, and it's perfectly themed as a dog house. I don't know if you guys have ever noticed that. It's really cool. Look at the size of that yo-yo. I stunk at yo-yo. Anybody in here good at yo-yo? I always stunk. And just like that, now I'm at Old Key West. But Lee, how did that happen? Just a little bit of pixie dust. I gotta say though, I love the color scheme here and I really love this overhang. Plus, it has one of the best entryways in. I'll show you in a second. Like, just look at this. It's got it all. Now I gotta go find my stroller. I really can't wait until they bring the ferries back. It's gotta be soon. I hope so. I hope it's soon. I found her. I found my baby. Ah, the old rocky shorelines. Pretty sure old Key West is the only one that has it. I love it. Looks like they're doing some uh, repaving here at old Key West. Here by building 29. Oh yeah, you can see it. All tore up. And just like that, now I'm in Art of Animation. I'm all over the place. I still got one more stop after this. Back where I started this whole vlog. I think this picture is appropriate for this song. If you're going my way. All right, so I'll wait for this person. Um, I ordered some breakfast because I'm starving, but I'm trying to eat healthier. So I'm going to have oatmeal. It's actually a... Um, if there was still the dining plan, it'd be a snack credit because it was only $3.49, I think. And you get raisins in it too, so awesome. I'll let you know, guys know how I like it. Well, that just stinks. Um, it's right, I ordered it right before 11, and I guess they stopped serving it at 11, so it glitched out, and I'm not getting my oatmeal. I'm a sad panda, but I am going to try it next time I'm here and I got time to kill. So like I was talking about before, they've already started phasing out the Magical Express buses. And actually, I should have filmed it earlier when I went to Pop Century. They had about seven of these all lined up and they just had a little a little sign in the front that said Magic Express. That's, you know, end of this year, gonna be it. Let's see what kind of bus brings my customer. Should be interesting. All right, looks like my customers are coming on a, one of the original Magic Express buses. Welcome home. Now Jen posted this on Instagram the other day. They have the new ones in too. Tigger. Eeyore. He actually has a smile on his face. That doesn't make sense. And then Piglet. 
Then they have some new outfits. They got a Snow White, Disney Bound. Uh, where's the other new ones? Man, the other new ones are already gone. Oh, no, there, here we go. They got some different like suits for Mickey or Donald, I guess, or whoever you want to put them with. Well, look at these are new too, with the little bandana. But you know what they don't have? Kermie and Piggy. Oh my goodness, this is new. I've never seen this. It's a canine crunchy coffee mug. There's nothing on the backside, but it just has like a picture of the TV. That is so cool. And that is $19.99. And here's another one I haven't seen before. That's a Princess Castle, Cinderella Castle, and then Moana, Ariel, Aura, Cinderella, Snow White, Belle, Tiana, some of them I can't tell, Brave, Pocahontas. But I like inside it says Fierce, Bold, Strong. And this one is only $14.99. Man, the music is blaring in here, but look at the, the drop off pool bar. They have a, a drink just for April the Tipsy Rabbit. Hopping Good Time blend of Lua and Strolly, uh, Stoli Van Il and a chocolate milkshake. I don't know if I'd like that. Okay, now it's on to Pop Century. Hopefully, they'll be ready when I get there. Fingers crossed. Here's what I was talking about earlier. Right here, you got four of them, and they have just a little Disney Magic Express sign. I'll try to zoom in. So they're prepping up these buses. Actually, I see what they're doing now. They're just there sitting, waiting for their times to go pick up guests. But it is still interesting how many are not actual Disney Magic Express buses. And now it's another day and I'm here at, hold on, let me turn it around. Grand Destino Tower. I love when you get here early, it's so peaceful. There's nobody out here. Look at the view. Does it get much better than this? This is my job. I just wish I got to do more. Hopefully one day we'll be so busy. I'll be hustling around instead of taking in all the sights. I guess I should uh, take this as a blessing. But just look at the tile work here. Man, that must have took a while to do. Unless it's like that strip stuff, but it doesn't look like that strip stuff. Like maybe this is like the strip, but there, that's all tile, that's all, yeah, that's all custom. Yeah, I definitely think, well, maybe not, no, that's not, that's not strip stuff either. Wow, this is just gorgeous. And these are like the biggest benches ever. Oh no, looks like somebody forgot a pair of sunglasses. Never mind what I thought was a sunglass case. Somebody just left their mask. I see them everywhere, man. People just toss them aside. Really, people? Leave your trash here. This fire pit's pretty cool. But I'll take care of this piece of trash. This is stupid. Literally, the trash can is right there. I'm like, come on, man. Did my part. Well, this is exciting, at least for a Disney nerd like me. I've been saying this every time I come here. I wonder if the, the rentals will come back. And they're back. They got bike rentals. Oh, fishing rentals. Like I said, you can, I think you can actually fish here now. They got huge fish in this lake. Bike rentals, fishing rentals, and then daily trips. Ooh. Might have to do a, a fishing video because they have huge fish here. There's something I haven't seen in a while. A Disney duck. Ooh, ducky. There's a turtle swimming along out there. Yep, there he goes, he went under. All right guys, that's gonna wrap up today's crazy. Oh look, I got my reading glasses on. <laughs> because I'm working on the vlog right now. 
Um, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure you hit the like button, tap the subscribe, ring the notification bell so you always know when a new video is headed your way. Thank you so much for watching, and we'll see you at the next adventure. Bye. Today's video brought to you by Orlando for Families. For amazing prices and even better customer service on all of your stroller rental needs for your Orlando vacation, visit them at the website listed below, www.orlandoforfamilies.com. Use the promo code OHANA to save 15% off of their already competitive prices.